Welcome back to Chinese Zero to Hero. This video is from our Path to Fluency course, with over 60 videos of useful tips and resources to help advanced students reach actual fluency. For more information, visit our website at ChineseZeroToHero.com. Enjoy this video! Welcome back to Chinese Zero to Hero Path to Fluency. In this video, let's take a look at how we can get Chinese ebooks. There are a few popular Chinese apps through which you can get a lot of ebooks in Chinese very easily. Many local libraries across the globe offer patrons free access to popular ebook platforms. Some of them have large collections of Chinese ebooks. Rakuten Overdrive is a popular e-library platform that many libraries have access to. Currently, it offers more than 80,000 Chinese titles. The number of titles you can access to depends on what your public library offers. You can access Overdrive and enjoy its content with the user-friendly Libby app. You can check with your local library for details on Overdrive access. The UDN Library is an ebook library in Taiwan. It can be accessed by patrons of many libraries across Taiwan as well as international libraries. For example, the San Francisco Public Library as shown here. And of course, you can also get a lot of paid ebooks from Google, Apple, and Amazon. For example, as shown here, Google Play Books offers Lu Xun's Na Han for $7.98, while Apple Books offers the same item for free, and Amazon Kindle offers it for $7.49. Weixin Dushu, or We Read, allows you to get free ebooks or paid ebooks in Chinese. Notably, the app allows you to compete with your friends and see who reads the most number of hours in a given week. Another great feature is that for every half hour that you spend reading, it rewards you the equivalent of one renminbi of digital cash that can be used toward future purchases. In my opinion, Weixin Dushu has the best visual design of all Chinese ebook apps, especially when it comes to typography and readability. The only downside is the seeming lack of proofreading. You can come across a lot of typos in the books. The screenshot shown here is Lu Xun's Na Han. It sold for 10 renminbi on WeRead. Dang Dang Yun Yue Du, or Dang Dang Cloud Reader, seems to have a larger selection than Weixin Yuedu. If for some reason you cannot find a book on Weixin Yuedu, you'll likely find it on Dang Dang Yun Yuedu. However, it does not reward you for reading the same way Weixin Yuedu does. And it doesn't have the Song font, which is the equivalent of the Serif font in English. Not having the Song font makes it a little bit harder to read. Shown here on this page is Lu Xun's Na Han for 10 renminbi. Douban Yuedu is also a popular reading app. However, it does not offer text-to-speech features as in Weixin Yuedu and Dang Dang Yun Yuedu, which means you can't select a portion of the text and have it read aloud to you. Also, if you use the Si Yuan Song Ti font, the word spacing feels a little bit too tight. It's a great app otherwise. The pricing of the books is also very reasonable. For example, as shown here, Lu Xun's Na Han sells for 4 renminbi. Douban Dushu is created by the same company as Douban Yuedu. However, unlike Douban Yuedu, Douban Dushu is not an ebook service. Rather, it's an online catalog of books, much like Goodreads. It allows you to discover books, search for a specific book, see what others say about the book, and find out how to get the book as an ebook, as a physical book, or from a public library in China. 
shown on this page is Lu Xun's Nahan. Amazon.cn, the Amazon store in China, also sells Kindle books. Once you buy an ebook on Amazon, you can read it through a Kindle app or through a Kindle device. But please note that your account with Amazon.cn is separate from your international Amazon account. So if you want to access your purchase from a Kindle, you need to log out of your international Amazon account and log in with your Amazon.cn or China account. Shown here is Lu Xun's Nahan for 96 cents renminbi. Chaoxing Dushu features a large library of scanned books. The effort to create the largest online Chinese library started back in 1999 and now has over 2.6 million items. These items can be read online, you can click the button Wang Ye Yue Du, or via Windows application. Shown on this page is Lu Xun's Nahan. Haodu is a website that features many free ebooks from Taiwan. The site was created by a book lover named Zhou Jianhui back in 2001. He will look for books that are out of copyright or out of print or hard to find, and he would digitize them, check for errors, and turn them into EPUBs for download. So on his website, you can find a lot of rare gems you may not find anywhere else. Shown here is Lu Xun's Nahan, which you can download for free. You can download EPUBs in horizontal or vertical formats, or you can read them online. Personally, I prefer downloading the EPUBs in vertical format and open them in iBooks because the typography looks better. Plus, I get to highlight text as I read. Another option is Rakuten Kobo Taiwan. If you already have a Kobo account from another country, you can use the same account seamlessly with the Taiwan store. Once you buy a book, it will show up in your bookshelf automatically along with your previous purchases from Kobo stores from other countries. Shown here is Lu Xun's Nahan for 160 Taiwan dollars. A third option is Read Mu or Du Mo. The website is very well designed. You can search for books in simplified or traditional characters. I was able to purchase books very easily using PayPal. You can read the books directly from your browser, or you can download their ebook app on iOS, Android, Windows, and macOS. Shown here is Lu Xun's Kuang Ren Ri Ji for 99 Taiwan dollars. Your fourth option is Bookwalker Taiwan, which offers many ebooks to registered users. After you sign up and confirm your email, you will be offered to browse their free ebooks. Once you add the free ebooks to a cart, you can use store value called Chu Jin to complete the payment, the quote unquote payment of zero dollars. Then you can read the free books in a web browser or by using their iOS or Android apps. The website's usability is a bit lacking. Alipay works only for Chinese nationals. So if you could get the payment to work, you will have a large selection of books from Taiwan. Personally, the payment system never worked for me because I'm not a Chinese national. Shown on this page is Chung Yao's Chuang Wai, sold for 228 Taiwan dollars. Another option is Tazi, Du Ce Sheng Huo. As shown here, Lu Xun's Pang Huang and Nahan together cost 75 Taiwan dollars. So these are your options for getting ebooks from mainland China and Taiwan. Try them out, and I will see you in the next video.